Hi, my name is Connor Gilbert, and I'm the Pittsburgh High School Student Council President. Hi, my name is Joseph Henderson, and I'm the Pittsburgh Student Council Vice President. Hi, my name is Natalie Garza, and I'm the Pittsburgh Student Council Secretary. For this year's Emerging Leaders Conference, the theme is teamwork, which is why we picked our project, Promoting Pirate Pride. The goal of this project is to bring our school and community closer through different partnerships, encouraging the idea of teamwork within our community. In our student council, we strive to act, assess the needs of our students and the members of our community. Through teamwork this year, our executive council was able to come up with several projects that emphasize promoting Pirate Pride. On our first slide is our goal. This includes answering what is the need, the scope, who needs to be involved, and who it will benefit. Our need is more cohesivity in the community and school, ensuring that Pittsburgh is the strongest team that we can be. In order to ensure that we can reach our scope, we had to know what our timeline was. In the summer, our executive officer team came together and planned out our projects that we wanted to complete each month over the course of the 2023-2024 school year. In order to ensure that we are promoting teamwork within our community, we also focused on who we wanted to involve in each project. We wanted to incorporate many organizations and businesses within our town of Pittsburgh and also different organizations within our school district. In order to accomplish our activities throughout the year, we created a timeline to ensure it was completed in a timely manner. We started with brainstorming our ideas and planning out the activity. Then we worked on carrying out the event. Next, we viewed the result of each activity and the feedback we were given to ensure our next projects run smoothly. Lastly, we reviewed our final results to ensure that we positively worked within our community. In August, our theme was back to school. One of the first events was when we teamed up with the Pittsburgh Rotary Club before school started. We helped them to host their teacher convocation, which welcomed back teachers to the new school year by holding the doors open, handing out programs to teachers, giving out door prizes, and cleaning up after the event. Our next partnering event was with the Pittsburgh High School principals and partnering with them to help out at Meet the Teacher. Student council members helped the freshman class to navigate their classes and pass out schedules to all students. Our last teamwork event in August was our District 19 planning and training session with D19. In this planning session, we worked with different student councils across our district and came up with our state service project. We will be implementing these ideas within our own school and our district in the spring. In September, our monthly theme was Autumns in the Air. Our first partnering project was when we held our gene drive with the Junior High School Student Council. We saw the need in our school to prepare the Junior High Student Council to become accustomed to the kind of projects that we in the High School Student Council carry out. This teamwork will later strengthen our Student Council and our impact. In September, our Student Council also partnered with God's Closet, which is our local food and clothing donation center. Members of our council volunteered to run the center and help pack up food boxes for those in need. This teamwork with an important nonprofit organization in our community helped to strengthen the bond between our school and town. In October, our monthly theme was Creeping It Real. This month, we partnered with Carter Blood Care in hosting a blood drive for our students, promoting unity within our students to encourage them to provide for those in need of blood donations. We also partnered with our local animal shelter in a project called Wishbone for Pets. In this event, we held a contest within our school and had each homeroom class raise as much money as they could for our animal shelter. We rewarded the winning class and were able to donate all the money we raised to the animals in need. In November, our monthly theme was Glad and Grateful. We first partnered with our local American Legion on Veterans Day. We helped them to host their ceremony commemorating those who have served in our town. Our teamwork here helped to show remembrance for our soldiers and involvement in our community. The next event we hosted in November was our towel drive with our local animal shelter. Throughout our school, we asked students to donate any new or gently used towels they had because we heard about the need for them at our animal shelter. Our teamwork with the student body and animal shelter helped to provide our shelter with more resources. In December, our monthly theme is currently Pirates Are Present. At the beginning of the month, we partnered with a nonprofit organization in our community called Camp County Christmas for Kids. We hosted a toy drive where all high school students were encouraged to donate toys to the kids in our community that are in need. We decided to team with this organization because a fourth of our town population are in poverty and would not be provided the opportunity to receive Christmas gifts. Our next December project we have been working on is our Nicotine Free Week that we hosted with all the campuses in our school district. With the primary school, we hosted a coloring contest where students were able to color a pair of healthy lungs versus damaged lungs, emphasizing the dangers of nicotine. For the elementary campus, we created a nicotine-free pledge poster. 
The students here colored a person and drew items or people inside that they would lose if they became addicted to nicotine. For our intermediate campus, we held an Able to Lead Olympics. In this event, we had students play a series of six games, which each emphasized the dangers of nicotine, the effects of peer pressure, and the importance of unity and teamwork against drugs. For our junior high campus, we recreated a nicotine-free quiz for students to learn more about the harmful substance. The winner of this contest received a prize, and all students gained knowledge on the topic. With all of these teamwork events that we hosted, our student council was given the opportunity to create a sense of strength and unity for our students and organizations in our town. We are excited to continue these monthly projects and events that promote partnership throughout the year.